Hello and welcome to Dinner Views. I'm Matthew Francis. And this is a show where I get to cook a dream dinner for my awesome friends who live here in Hollywood and interview them about their life, career, and their views on the world. And I have a super special guest, Salorm, here today. <laughs> Delisa Calderon, <laughs> Sheila here today. Hey! Nikki Ang with me. Get up over Hi. here. Hey! <laughs> this is Jess Maroney. Uh, Kevin Wynn, <laughs> Keanu Moju, Joyce Louis Jean. Aww. Yeah, I love him. I love him so much. Okay. Hey guys, Matthew here. Can you believe it? You get a full on recipe video this week because in the future, I'm hoping to show all the recipes for the food I cook for my dinner view guests. Yep, that's right. I'm just trying to give you more awesome food content. This recipe isn't a part of a normal dinner view, but it is the first video I filmed in my teeny tiny apartment here in Hollywood after leaving my job at Buzzfeed to start working as a private chef. It's seared steak with chimichurri sauce over Yukon gold potatoes with a blood orange beet and fennel salad. <laughs> I know, it's, uh, it's a mouthful, but trust me, this dish is so worth the work. So I hope you make it at home. And now, while you watch the rest of this recipe video, enjoy some of the best moments of Dinner Views Season 1 so far. You can watch the full episodes here on YouTube or listen on iTunes and Spotify. Check it out! In my 27 years of life, I've always told myself, because I don't have one focus, that I don't have passion. Mm. That like, I'm never going to succeed until I find that one thing. And that narrative is berserk. Like, is, that yeah. was the narrative that like, I think probably a lot of people tell themselves. Mm -hmm. <laughs> like, you don't even notice that you're good at what you do. You don't even notice how good you're doing because adulthood is just about worrying about the next problem. Yeah. I do believe also that once you have an idea come to your mind, it is your responsibility to yourself for your growth to make that happen. I don't want it just to be like outside people coming in being like, look at this stuff. It's like, let people have a voice of showing you. It's yeah. like, you can go to someone's house and show them around, or they can show you around their own house. Having lived out here for a few years, I started getting really comfortable. Yeah. And then I was just like, wait, like, you know, comfort doesn't bring growth. Right. Right. As a person of color, the reality check is always there. I mean, it's mm. always like you, oh, you look, there you, go. That's a good point. you look and you're like, ain't nobody black up in here. Yeah. You know, ain't nobody black ever in here, you know? It's disheartening and I, I see it with so many other groups as well. We need to support each other. We need to support each other's projects. I still struggle with it. I still feel like it takes me a while to just really like believe that I can do something. Yeah. I feel like I do need validation from people. I do mm. need people to be like, you can do it. But like, if you can't believe it yourself, like how are you gonna convince other people? I think this is where just like good friends come in. Yeah. And like people like you, yeah. when you're like, no, that's not true. Yeah. I know this about you. Yeah. I know you're someone who can do this. You yeah. are capable. Look at your history of being capable. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And even if you do fail, who cares? Yeah, yeah. Just give it a shot. Man. Aren't my friends awesome? Hilarious and heartfelt. They're so great. How did I get so lucky? And honestly, this is just a tidbit of all the incredible conversations we have in each of their dinner views. And just in time because this recipe video is almost over. And so I'll finish this off by saying my last three guests on the show for season one are BuzzFeed's Curly Velasquez, Peril Likes Maya Murillo, and Tasty's Alex Traeger. And I cannot wait to share our conversations with you. Now it's time for the actual dinner. Oh my God. Oh, oh my God. You made those from scratch? From scratch, yeah. God. Matthew! <laughs> this is no joke. Oh, hell yes. This is beautiful. Okay. Matt, the hospitality. <laughs> does, oh. does it look good? Does it look how does you remember it? Does it look okay. good? Well, friends, thank you so much for watching and listening to Dinner Views so far. All the links to find extra content of mine are down in the description box below. If you want to see even more bonus footage from the show or send videos in of you asking questions to my guests and actually be on the show, head on over to my Patreon for all those extra perks. I'm so glad you're here with spending time with me and supporting me. It really means the world, so thank you. And there is much more to come. I'll see you next week. Bye.